American, Christian, televangelist, and television celebrity Paula Michelle Furr was born on the 20th of April, 1966 in Tupelo, Mississippi, and as Paula White is also known as a co-founder of Without Walls International Church in Tampa, Florida in the United States. If you ever wondered just how rich Paula White is as of late 2017, well, according to Celebrity.Money, it's estimated that Paula's net worth is over $5 million, mostly coming from her talk show, Paula White Today, airing on the Trinity Broadcast Network. Paula also established 10 successful books, adding somewhat to her wealth. Paula now owns a house valued at $2.1 million on Bayshore Boulevard in Tampa and a condo in Trump Tower in New York City, which is valued at $3.5 million. Paula's childhood was not the one you read about in books, as her parents divorced only five years after Paula was born, and soon other unfortunate events started to happen. Paula and her mother moved to Memphis, but in a few years her financial status crumbled, and they were only existing as a result of which her mother gave herself away to alcohol. But as she was working, Paula was given over to the custody of many guardians, some of whom Paula had claimed molested her in her early childhood. When she was nine years old, her mother remarried and moved with Paula to Washington, D.C., alongside her new husband, who served in the military at the National Naval Medical Center. Paula attended the Seneca Valley High School in Maryland, from which she received her diploma. While still in Maryland at the age of 18, Paula married Dean Knight and converted to Christianity. They have one child, but their marriage lasted less than two years. When she was 28, Paula received a word from God, claiming that a vision was sent to her by God, and through her mouth declared His word, where many people were healed and saved by His Spirit. But when she stopped talking, they would fall into darkness. So God said that she was summoned by Him to preach the gospel. Later on, White became a member of the National Church of God in Fort Washington under T.L. Lowry of the Church of God and a church in Gathersburg, Damascus, Maryland area. When she volunteered as a janitor in a church in 1989, Paula met Randy White, a third-generation preacher in the Church of God denomination. Randy was divorced and trying to reestablish his career as a preacher and evangelist. Paula and Randy dated for many months and worked on a couple of projects, during which Randy asked her to marry him, which she accepted, and then moved from Maryland to Tampa, Florida. Shortly after moving to Florida, Paula and Randy founded the South Tampa Christian Center in 1991. In the first few years of its existence, the two of them coped with a lack of finances, so lived with the help of government assistance and charity. However, the church started to rise thanks to its outreach policy. In seven years, the church's location was moved three times until it finally it was permanently based in Tampa, changing its name to Without Walls International Church. In 1999, it was reported that there were 5,000 visits to the church weekly and another 10,000 believers outside with 230 ministers preaching. In 2001, Paula started her television career with her debut broadcast of Paula White Today, which aired on multiple networks for five years and which increased her net worth by a large margin. Paula was praised by Ebony Magazine, describing her as the most popular white preacher on the Black Entertainment Network. Without Walls International Church expanded in 2002 to Lakeland, counting 14,000 members and 200 ministers. It also started holding Saturday night services at Carpenter's Home Church in the Lakeland property, which was rented, then later bought for $8 million and renamed to Without Walls Central Church. In 2004, the church counted 20,000 members, making it the seventh largest church in the U.S. No doubt Paula's net worth was also benefiting too. Throughout her service as a minister, Paula has met many powerful people, including former British Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher, Prime Minister of Israel Benjamin Netanyahu, and Presidents George H.W. Bush and George W. Bush. She is also a life coach of Tyra Banks, from which she appeared on her show in 2006. Paula has administered to many famous people, including Michael Jackson, Gary Sheffield, and Donald Trump, who apparently often came for private Bible lessons. Hmm. In January of 2012, Paula became a senior pastor in New Destiny Christian Church in Apopka, Florida, succeeding the former senior pastor Zachary Timms following his death. Most recently, White delivered the invocation at President Trump's inauguration on the 20th of January 2017 and was subsequently named to chair the Evangelical Advisory Board in the President's administration. Perhaps consequently, in July of 2017, Paula was listed at number three in Orlando Magazine's 50 Most Powerful 2017 Philanthropy and Community Voices. In other aspects of her life, Paula and Randy were divorced in 2007, and she subsequently married rock musician Jonathan Cain in 2015. 